Hey guys, it's your girl Danielle and I'm back with a really, really, really uh, quick haul. Just some stuff that I picked up from MAC. I know I haven't done one in a while. Um, there's some new lines that's coming up, so hopefully I might see something I'd like to get the whole line maybe. But uh, for right now, just, just a few things that I picked up. Uh, first and foremost, um, the Viva Glam. Nicki Minaj and Ricky Martin um, is coming up February 16th. Ricky Martin is going to have his own like lip conditioner um, universal so men and women can use it. Nicki Minaj has her own lipstick and uh, if you sign up, if you go to uh, mattcosmetics.com, you sign up to get on the list, uh, you can go ahead and purchase the Nicki Minaj lipstick before it comes out on, I'm sorry, February 15th. Now the Viva Glam comes out, but I was able to get it early. I just received it yesterday, uh, matter of fact, last night in the mail. And it's just, you know, Viva Glam, Nikki. And I'm actually wearing it right now. And it's, it just comes in a, a black with a red label from MAC um, this year. And it's just like a subtle pink, um, I want to say like a strawberry pink. I know with the different lighting, let me turn this one on. Okay, well, you can see it a little bit better. But it's just like a strawberry pink. I know with the light is making it look like a bubblegum pink, but it's really just like a bright pink. You know, she's into the bright um, this is $14, $15, I believe, but it's a great pink. You know, I had to moisturize because my issues with pink lipsticks, they'll, they'll bleed or they're chapped. So, um, I just use a lip scrub and then I put some of the lip conditioner from MAC on and put this on, but I really like it. I don't even need to put like a lip glass on top. It's really moisturized pink. So, that's the Nicki Minaj. Uh, moving on on I've got uh three eyelashes I got these are the number these are the number six lashes these are the number forty four these are kind of like a black brown in color they're really wispy drama 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 <laughs> and let's put these back in the bag <sighs> come on bag okay and these are the number 48 yeah 48 so those are the three lashes I wanted to get something real you know is going to stand out with the look so those three the six the 44 and the 48 really stand out but for those that want something simple they do have like natural looking lashes so check it out um more powder puffs because the way i go through them the little black on the cover just falls off so i got two more and i found this really pretty mineralized blush and usually i don't uh, do mineralized blush. I do the mattes because they stand out more. But when I saw this, um, this is really pretty. This is Gleeful. And it's like this. It's like a warm. If I had to give it a color, I'm going to say like a warm apricot. Um, I've been trying to get my hands, y'all, on the, min uh, the MAC Natural Collection. I've been trying to get all three um, blushes. And both of the Miller Skin finishes, the blonde and redhead, but it's like all three of the blushes are sold out and just the MSFs or the MSFs are sold out and all the blushes. So MAC has substitutes uh, for them just on the blushes. So Gleeful will be like a substitute for, I believe, uh, not fresh honey, but it's like early morning. There we go. I believe that's it. Just to give you like a little swatch. See, it's very light. Now the color, you know, kind of disguises you, but um, 
It's really, really, really pretty. Kind of like a, yeah, like I said, like a deep apricot color. Moving on. Uh, let's see, I got um, just a couple of the um, glitter and ice eyeshadows. Uh, this is winterized. And it's uh, kind of like a plum purple with swirls of silver in it. It looks like this. Like that. And I've got all three. This one is Shimmer Mint. And this is like a blue green with hints of silver and pink flex it looks like this these really sparkly it's really pretty and when you wet these they really intensify in the color payoff and the last one that I got from the collection is hold that pose and this has a lot of colors going on. I'm going to say coral, pink, black, purple with hints of silver sparkle. And it's like this. And put it right here. So that and shimmer mint has a whole lot of shimmer. This is more like a green silver sparkle. This is a pink purple sparkle. So... And check those out before they get ready to um, discontinue those. I know if you go to the uh, gone, gone, going, going, gone section online, you can still get them. Uh, let's see. Oh, I was able to get my hands on um, the paint pots. This is the one that I had the trouble getting my hands on. I finally got it. This is Let's Skate. And it's like a silvery, sparkly paint pot. And the other one that I got. Let's see here. Oh. Uh, for effect. And this is a black silver sparkle. Those, yeah, those are the, uh, yeah, those are the two uh, paint pots that I got. And yes, just uh, online, usually, um, this is the green gel cleanser, but online from MacCosmetics.com, they ran out of the bigger one that comes like the same size as like Fix Plus. But uh, they went ahead and uh, they were out of those, so they gave me this one um, for like nine bucks. And the regular size one is like ten, so I'm not really too complaining about that. I'll probably just go to my local um, MAC Cosmetics in one of the malls and just pick up a bigger one. But this is that uh, a brush cleaner. I have not cleaned my brushes in two months. Bad, bad, Danielle. But this is the brush cleaner. Um, for those that, um, this is like $13, but you can pull an old school move and just use like a good shampoo and disinfectant mixing together to clean your brushes. I know usually I'll just take my brush and wipe it off on an old rag if I don't clean them, but since it's been too much, I don't want to get, you know, any, um, discoloration, infections or anything, so... FYI, if you can clean them at least once a month, that's really good. But for me, I got to get on the ASAP and clean it. Uh, I got a Studio Tech Foundation in NC45. Uh, this one I haven't opened yet. I'm trying to show you an old... Let me just go ahead and open it up. Because I don't want to knock this camera over. This is Studio Tech nc45 and um for those that um my makeup forever people the ones that get the hd foundation this will be the equivalent to it if you uh, it comes with the foil covering so once you peel it off 
you know, there's the color. This is uh, for my people that want full coverage. Full coverage, not medium, not maybe, but full coverage. That's that. Uh, just some other stuff. Uh, I got another eyebrow pencil. This is in strut. And uh, I got a Pro Longwear lip glass. Because uh, I think these go for about a 10 hour wear. This is full speed ahead. This is from the Gone Going collection. This They're about to get ready to discontinue this. But this will really look good on top of this Nicki Minaj lipstick that I have. But I'm not going to put it on. I'm just going to try to rock this on its own. But this is full speed ahead. You know, we can see. Can you see? Yeah, full speed ahead. It's a pretty uh, pinky color. And I think that's... Oh, no. uh, got a paint pot. This is an Indian wood. I needed something. I need the actual paint pot because the sample that I got from the body needs too is already gone. <laughs> I use it that much. It's a really pretty color. And you can also rock these alone. It's like a beautiful bronze gold color. And last but not least, um, Mac. I got a mixing medium. And this one I haven't heard too much about, but this is um, it's small. Now, just to let you know, like this. It's going to come in a little bitty box. This is a mixing medium. And this is Shine. And what it is, um, from what I read, it's just like this. And basically, if you mix uh, any loose uh, eyeshadows, pigments with it, it's going to bring out the shine. Now, with uh, mixing medium, um, when I mix those together, it intensifies the color. But this one's going to make it even more shinier. But a trick that I learned from one of the MAC uh, Cosmetics online, for some people that have trouble with... Um, applying concealer on their other eye and you know it fades away or when they set it if you mix a little bit of this with concealer and put it on it's going to stay supposedly um from the demonstration that i saw they got like a little just a dab of this and then put concealer on their hand mixed it and then put it under their eyes and just the way that the concealer is like it, it made it real shiny um as soon as they set it with the pro uh, with the powder no problem. They showed another clip like about two hours later and the lady that they put it on is like her concealer would be gone. Uh, it would be kind of blotchy, but it looked the same way as when they applied it a couple of hours ago. So I'm going to give that a try and let you know. I'll probably go ahead and just do like a separate review just on this and um, let you know how it really works. And that's it <laughs> that's all that i purchased from mac um mac has a spring collection coming out on the 16th um the big one that they're really boasting about is like the mac cook and the mac shop they have like these women with these bright bright colors like with shopping baskets it's supposed to be like four eyeshadow quads coming out and then with the cook it's like these makeup up to the fullest color like drag queen almost uh with the bright colors um holding pots and pans cooking they're supposed to have like lip glasses and lipsticks and lip pencils um the one that's coming out on the 16th i uh, know the only thing i'm probably going to snag is the vera collection they're re promoting the pearl glide like the, the pencils the coals the ones that have the sparkle with it uh i can't give you the correct name right now because my mind is going a little bit blank and yeah that's it um for new collections that coming that are coming out and you want to get more detail of it check out Temptelia. it's www.temptalia.com that's where i go to um she's like the biggest blogger that i know she gets to hook up on upcoming collections not just from mac but nars uh uh Chanel, uh, just a whole lot of other stuff and her reviews on uh, 
drugstore products are really good too so check her out i'll leave the link below but yeah that's my little bitty mini mac haul um i hope you guys have a good one i need to hurry up and wake up my son i know you can probably still hear him snoring and getting ready for school happy friday you guys have a safe weekend over the super bowl and everything going on i'm just concerned with watching the commercials but <laughs> y'all have a good one and i will talk to y'all later bye guys